All right, ranger choke. Come on out. The ranger choke is the only choke we're going to cover on this series simply because A, it's the easiest, and B, it's the best. Why mess around with me teaching you the proper way to do a rear naked choke, whatever. We can cover that later, right? This, this is all about efficiency and effectiveness. Ranger choke, simply taking your hand like a claw, grabbing the trachea, voice box, this entire area right here, as hard as you can. I'm going to pretend I'm grabbing as hard as I can because I don't want them to pass out on me. I need them, right? And just like everything else, we need to have a back, all right? Whether this, if this is the wall, obviously you don't need to put your hand here. If this is the floor, you don't need to put your hand here. But when he's standing up, you're grabbing, putting on the back of his neck, and squeezing as hard as you can, all right? I don't care who they are. I've surprised everybody with this. Judo Olympians, Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu black belts, right? This is totally illegal in competition, all right? Totally illegal in MMA, totally illegal in friendly, because it's mean. All right? This is mean. You can literally damage somebody here. I'm not talking about ripping someone's throat out. Right? That, that's all Hollywood nonsense. What we're talking about is squeezing, cutting off the air, and cutting off the blood at the same time. Right? And whether you're twisting and putting him down all right, and holding him, now you have him wherever you can do whatever you want. You can let go, wait till he passes out. You could let go anytime you want to. Are, are you right there? <laughs> you okay? Okay. <laughs> All right, doesn't matter. Ranger choke is everywhere. It's anywhere. It's freaking amazing. You can, I pulled this off on the ground in training, just, you know, against guys that didn't suspect it just for fun. Um, we used to do drills where we used to throw um, a handgun with some munition, which is basically wax bullets that goes at the same feet per second as a bullet across the room, and then we'd have to go fight for it, see who could get to it first. You don't want to be the guy who doesn't get that gun first. Secret move was always boom, tackle the guy and ranger choke, right? So let's work this into the whole sequence, all right? Minding your business, guy's yelling at you, comes up, boom, all right? Lift up your hand, stop that attack. Stop the attack, drive back in, doesn't matter, he's open. He's open. As soon as you see that neck, you latch on that ranger choke, you squeeze as hard as you can, and you bring him down. All right. If you need to let it go, you can choke him right, right, right from here until he passes out, all right, or gases out, or some other nasty stuff. Otherwise, let go and put your boots on him. All right. All right. Let's cover how I'm actually taking him down with the ranger choke. You don't actually have to take someone down. If you've driven them off balance, all right, and you lock this on, you can choke them out from up here, and they'll fall down. That's fine. But if you want to take them to the ground. So you, as soon as I put the little pressure, if you want to take them to the ground, all you got to do is twist, and that's it. All right? I'm not doing anything special. All I'm doing is literally just moving my body from here and following how my, the pressure of my hand is driving them back while the pressure of this hand is driving them back in. So I can't go this way. All right? I can't really go back, and I can't go forward because I'm totally compressing all right? his throat in the back of his neck with my hand. So the only way I have, if I want to take him to the ground, is to take him to the, the hand side that's on the back of his neck. And all I'm doing, literally, because there's so much pressure on his neck, right, on his throat, he's struggling to breathe. What will happen most of the time is he's gonna grab this hand, right, and try, and try, try to take it off, right? It doesn't really matter, because as soon as you grab in there and twist back, right, it's even better, and now you have him.